Hi, my name is Miguel from AvoidErrors.net. I recently installed Windows XP on Oracle VirtualBox, and upon installation, I notice I have no internet access. This is most likely uh, caused because of missing network card drivers. If I go to Device Manager, you'll notice that Ethernet controller might have a question mark. There it is. To fix this, all we need to do is just install the uh, network card drivers. But first, let's install Guest Editions. Go to Devices. From the drop-down, select Insert Guest Editions. Next to the wizard, I'm going to leave everything default, so I'll click Next and Install. Once installed, select I want to manually reboot later and click Finish. And then turn off your guest operating system, Windows XP. Once off, go to the um, Intel's website. The link is in the description box below. And here, download the proper driver depending on which version of Windows XP you installed, whether it's 32 or 64 bit. In my case, I installed the 32. I'll click on the big blue button, accept the terms, and save to my downloads folder. I'll navigate to that folder. Oh, there it is. And now I'm going to create a shared folder. This folder is going to be shared with our guest operating system, Windows XP. And it will contain the um, driver executable. So I'll just drag and drop it to that folder. I'll rename it to XP drivers. Make sure that it contains the uh, executable. And then share the folder. What I'm going to do is I'm going to generally share with everyone, so everyone will have read and write permissions. So bear with me here. My mouse is not working in this section, but all I did was share with everyone and apply and OK. Security, add everyone. and again to have full control. In case you're concerned about security, you can always delete the folder once you're done. Now run Oracle VirtualBox. Here select Windows XP, Settings, Shared Folders, Add a folder. From the folder path, drop down, select Other, and look for XP drivers in this case. Select it, click OK, and check mark Auto Mount, click on OK. Then go to Network, make sure Enable Network Adapter is checked. Attached to NAT is fine. Under Advanced, make sure that Intel Pro 1000 Desktop is selected. In case it doesn't work, you can come back and select Bridged Adapter. But we, meanwhile, I'll leave it uh, default and then and start my Windows XP guest operating system. Okay. Now, as you can see, I still don't have internet access. So I'll go to my computer and locate that uh, folder I'm, I'm sharing with the uh, XP guest. Go inside and run the uh, driver executable. Next, I'll leave everything default, accept the license, and install. Once done, finish the wizard, and you should have access to the internet now. There you go. Thank you for watching this video. My name is Miguel. If you have any questions, feel free to post them in the comment section below. Thank you for watching. Now, if you're interested on more related video tutorials, you can watch me convert a physical computer into a virtual machine. Just click on the thumbnail on the screen.